Yeah, I'm wearing maternity leggings. <laughs> yes. I'm wearing maternity leggings. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So we have had a bit of a problem this week, haven't we? I have a problem every fucking day of the week. You know that we love our chickens. And I still love them. But what I don't love is any time I, like I bring something up and it's not even criticism. You're starting to, and I hate to be rude. Don't You're starting say it. to take don't. things, I'm not going to, don't. extremely personally in your yep. old age. <laughs> okay? Our chickens have developed a confidence that is so in fact confident. Yeah, they've that got confidence. They're escaping. Borderline intimidating. I was out there, I thought, I'm gonna go and garden. And I couldn't. Yeah. Because I was being you attacked! Had nothing, you had nothing to garden. Rosie, what I was trying to oh, do I was hoeing. Nothing. I was hoeing, you were hoeing my soil. Babe, did your brain tell you to go and do that? That was so cute. How unbelievably right? condescending I mean, of you. What's wrong with your I was preparing my soil. Are they flaring? They do that when I'm upset or lying. The fact that you just said, did your brain <laughs> think about doing that? At least I didn't think You're a really pigeon not. was going into the bird box with a whole lap. <laughs> she was like, oh no, it's in it the pigeons are using it. And I was like, no. <laughs> Every day, several times a day, started moaning about the chickens. Now, this no, is the woman that's not true. who bought the world's worst dog. Leave her alone. I already know who I you're talking so about. Much. No, you don't. She's allergic to everything. She's sick constantly. We're like, I, I sat the other day eating food, right? And I stood up and I slipped over. She can because hear you. I was like, who's poured soup on the floor? Oh, Wilma's thrown up again. She growls if you move your legs, if she sits on the bed, like literally. She's like, Marr. She well, hates the my God, she's just moving. She attacks boxes. Yeah, she, she's, she's honestly evil. I love her. I was sat on the landing the other day and I was looking out the window thinking oh I can't wait for spring maybe I'll do some hoeing and I saw Rachel and Bestie walking around the front and I was like what the fuck are they doing in the front how the fuck did they get that so I opened the gate I said get back in and they did actually yeah, they, they did, did. They did. if you go I came out the other day and they'd escaped for the first time they were by our car so I went what are you doing get inside and they just went rawr, rawr, rawr. we got a dog right and we got a dog trainer right rose made me spend money and hire a dog trainer i saw him in kfc the other day rose yeah. forgot his name it was really awkward no i didn't he I did you went oh no, uh, on the way out on the way out I no, got, you didn't know i was no, like I didn't. Vinny. and you're like Vinny. yeah it was on the way out my brain didn't work and i went bye saggy or whatever <laughs> <Jim> Simmy. <laughs> yeah because we we're buying a singer and then he's Vinny. so i was like zinny <laughs> Anyway, let me tell you about my doctor's note thing. Let me oh tell you my god, okay. I can't believe this happened to me, right? This is another classic example of the way that we got treated yeah. today. I walked in today, right, into uh, the doctor's, and I went up to the receptionist and I went, Hi, um, I'm here for a doctor's note for my son. And she said, What's his name? And I told her. She knew exactly what I was talking about yeah. because she opened a drawer and got out a basket of doctor's notes and looked through them, right? She couldn't find mine, got angry instantly, right? I went, What's his name? And I told her again. And she went, Right, what's his date of birth? I said, Right, the 1st of the 7th, 21. She put it in. No, she put it in. Yeah, no, she put it in and went, The 7th of the 1st, 21. And I was like, No. And then she said our address. And I was like, Yeah, that's me. And she went, What are you here for? And I was like, A doctor's note for my son. And she went, A doctor's note. <laughs> and I went, Yeah. <laughs> And she said it again. A doctor's note. A doctor's note. I think she knows what it means. Well, she does, because when, well, she, went when I, she went through the basket. A doctor's note. And I went, yeah. And she went. <laughs> she just looked at me for ages, and I was like. Because nursery was sending him home, so the doctors wrote a note. Because he's okay. And then she slammed everything down, went out the back, right? And she came back like this, right? This doctor's note is the best, the best doctor's note. note and the most aggressively written. It's right, actually shouting written out. out. You. It's so, written in caps. Some things I, I can't pronounce, doctor. right? Some things I can't pronounce. It's so capitalized. I'll do it. Ziggy has post-infectious malabsorbative diarrhea. He has been tested for rotavirus, E. coli, salmonella. What the hell is salmonella? And shigella. They are all negative. Underlined. And unless he has fever and vomiting, there is no reason. reason. Underlined why he cannot safely return to Okay. There's no arguing with that, babe. That no doctor argument. will kill you. I love you. that doctor. Wish I'd gone and saw him. Yeah, me too. Speaking of doctor's notes, this video is sponsored by Surfshark. Surfshark. In case you didn't already know, Surfshark is an app or browser extension that lets you place your laptop or device anywhere in the world and lets you access the internet as if you're in that country. This means you can use Surfshark to globally stream all your favourite shows no matter where you are. Surfshark is a VPN that doesn't keep logs meaning. It doesn't monitor, store or keep track of your online whereabouts or actions. 
in any, any way. way. So surf in a clean cyber ocean with no ads, trackers, malware, or phishing attempts. Surfshark is a VPN that offers one account to use on an unlimited number of devices. So secure your privacy with Surfshark and use our code Rose and Rosie to get three extra months for free. Surfshark even offers a 30 day money back guarantee, so there's no risk to try out for yourself. Link in the description box below. I miss my Botox top up. I don't think you need a Botox top up. I do. With respect. I do. You look great though. Thank you. I'm so glad you haven't had a migraine, although you did have one. I had one, but I also had one that went away. What did I say? <laughs> it goes from cute to creepy yes. really fast, like really fast. What do you think of couples that have like pet names for each other, but say those pet names in public? Like, but yeah, like, most, what, like, oh God, there are people that I'm not gonna name and shame, but there are people I know close to me I that, have, that have, oh, I do. and I can't like, for example. Wrong. You can't out them like that, I don't, Yeah, I don't <laughs> mind it. I don't mind them having it. But it's, like, but it's like, do they use those names during SUL? Because like, I'd rather you didn't. What's your pet name, Bobby? Well, I've started it's... calling her Bobby now. We're just both Bobby. Yeah. Used to be Wone and Wony. And then it's Baby Bobby and no, Wony. And now it's Bobby and Bobby. Bobby. And, and you text me when I'm putting the baby to bed. Rose texts me, how good, Bobby? I'm like, oh, how good, how, how boy were you, Bobby? And that's what Bobby says. Yeah. Sorry, it's over now. Not at night. What, sex? At night. I can't, I can't do it at night. I have no I'm time. too tired. Right, either, I'm bloated either and he I'm goes tired. to bed early, right? Which you'd think we'd be like, oh, we've got all evening, but it's like, yeah. right, he's gonna wake up at four in the morning. Clean the house! I've got to go to sleep, right? And Shall if he goes to bed late, the dogs. then I'm shattered. And I'm like, sorry, Rose, I've got to go to sleep. You're like, I've got to clean out the chickens, bye. And I'm like, yeah. yeah. There's always something I've got to do. Seriously, isn't that life? Isn't Ugh. that being an adult? Babe, don't you think it's really stupid, right? I'm not even joking. Yeah. Oh, babe, can I tell you something I thought about the other day? I am the ant dog. Yeah, I went yeah, for what but can I tell you something? Please. Right, babe, don't you think it's a bit weird? And I actually think it's a conspiracy theory, right? You know, we can understand other languages, right? <sighs> Mind blowing already. What do you mean? You know, like, you can learn another language, yes. right? So people have, before there was planes and travel, right? We all lived in different like countries and spoke our own language, yeah? Crazy. But we all invented our own language. Crazy, right? And now we can like fly across the world and we have the internet and stuff. But we can be like, oh, I can speak um, Spanish, right? I can't, but yeah. yeah. So you can yeah. speak Spanish. And did you know there's even TikToks that tell you they understand baby sounds, right? Like certain sound, like air, eh, one of them means like wind me, one of them means I'm hungry. Yeah. You know, so why can't we understand what animals say? And we could do all this stuff, right? And people have loads of money and technology. I truly believe that the government knows what animals say, and but they don't tell us because we wouldn't eat them. But I think they- That's blown. Cause my babe it's true and i've mind. invented this theory let's like, like let's just think about it. let's break it down right how can we know what babies are saying we know all other languages we can understand we can even transcribe ancient texts right so if they find an ancient language that isn't spoken now that what are they called the people who crack codes people can read what numbers say shut up that they can't know what animals say it must be basic it's actually child's play i reckon of all the things someone invented algebra say. and i just don't believe we've gone to the moon but we don't know what to say i reckon they all know what they're saying i reckon it's a thing but yeah we wouldn't eat animals no one would because they're like oh they talk and it's too far don't you think i actually do and i invented that in my brain guys don't forget to check out surfshark using the link in the description box below secure your privacy using our code rose and rosie for an extra three three months for free not one not two but three Three. Three. Free. Make sure you take care of yourselves. Oh. I've just spent 30 minutes filming and I do need to poo. And if you need a doctor's note, I know a doctor. I know a guy. He'll shout at you. Bye! <laughs>